this gathering. Rick Tyler uh, worked on the Cruz campaign for much of the campaign. Uh, Rick, what about what you just witnessed? Look, I thought this meeting was uh, very smart, very substantive. Ted Cruz uh, put people back into the Republican Party, reminding them back of their roots, and it's rooted in freedom. And that was refrain over and over again, that this is a party that's rooted in freedom, and more government means uh, less choice, less freedom, and he tied that together. I don't personally understand that, look, this is, you know, to, to disagree with Chris a little bit, this is, this is his party, too. This is a Republican Party. He's there. I was with him this afternoon with 1,200 uh, delegates who, were, who came out to support and see Ted Cruz. He's got a lot of support uh, in that room. And uh, look, when he didn't endorse him, and I, I'm not sure what the benefit would be to him to endorse him, that some people in the, in the crowd were going to be upset and they were going to boo, and that's what they did. But I think people liked the speech, and even a New York delegate there said he, he loved the substance of the speech. I thought it was a terrific speech. Well, uh, hang on a second, Rick. I mean, Princeton undergrad, Harvard Law, he's not dumb, and he knew every no. word in that speech, and he also knew what was omitted, and so do you. He had a he had a huge opportunity there. Well, you know, as you say, an opportunity to endorse, but he said for people to vote their conscience. And ultimately, that's what people have to decide to do. Uh, Ted Cruz is going to work for the Republican Party up and down the ticket uh, beyond uh, the, the presidential candidate, which he has not endorsed uh, and is probably unlikely to do so.